streets but talk of peace And walk the streets where artsy markets be Many promoters rub on them but yo they talk is cheap right. Across the street I see a couple cats sparking beef Lost to me as into urban youth and heat for cheap prices I operate my devices Transmit through speakers to communicate what life is Give them more than just my two bad knuckles to fight with Spirit motivated to elaborate that Christ lives I'm a fan of the slam dance passionate movement When the chains loosen, crash course exclusive Landscape destructive with a love for trying to build Start from scratch to accurately capture what I feel I'm ill from a contagious sickness I'm in the midst of individuals channeling energy So intense that it's instant upon exposure Ready to strike like the cobra I can tempt for what I know is truth until the game Come on now You're listening to the Stewart Media and Entertainment Network. The show is coming up in about two minutes. Don't go away. Stay tuned. Identify with the positive vibe. Optimus opportunities not often an offer options. Dangerous mind with a clear conscience. Open up and you might get it. That's right. I said it. One of the four to testify. You're living like head. If your fault might check tenant. Put it in it. Abraham to send it. Better reckon it. Isolate your style so you're not tempted to blend it with the temperament of the popular developing tenement to skill. That's why I make sure my step to the rhythm's original. Skip the bullseye. Common vision ends up in crowded centers. An orthodox approach so I aim for the outer edges. It's about to be on and popping. Show coming up in about a minute and a half. Stay tuned. On and on, I'm on the Odyssey, auditing in the product of modern artistry. Don't bother me, I'm honestly starting too hard into all of the common songs. I'm talking our problems, but never commenting on proper ways to solve. Call a response from the audience is all the doll that needs to start it all against right. all them. And said it, our investments would expose the hearts and uh-huh. tenants. All the yes, we're all dissolving. Yeah, You're all locked and loaded and listening to the Stuart Media and Entertainment Network. Y'all don't hear me, though. The show is coming up in about 30 seconds. Don't go away. Stay tuned. Uh-huh. Solve a bit of numbers while the crowd was getting lost in it. The gathering for unity has proved to be the Started. Yeah, hip hop is an economist, so like, I'll have a problem with it. Can't we all just play our role and live the way that God intended? Yeah. Cause see, when the song is ended, try not to be all offended. I'm coming to shots intending to water the land in me. <laughs> Yo, 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 check this out, check this out. Wait till they pick up the phone. Check this out. Hello, Puppet Factory. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Can I speak to Dan Patrick or, or Colin Cowherd or Skip Bayless or that ninja Stephen A. Smith? Nah, bro. They not here. Hey, hey, yo, tell them. Dougie Stewart and the Stewie said, since they think they show hot and they sports talk, guy talk soldiers, tell them we'll go to war. Listen up, sports talk show fans and puppet factory refugees. Tired of predictable rants, relentless bullish, and politically correct propaganda? No worries. Doug Stewart to the rescue. Oh, poke ass Tom Brady! The police think they can shoot a ninja in the back just because he's a ninja? I say... Yes, sir! Get the hell out of here with that scripted sports talk radio. Because you just entered the TDSS zone. Ball peanuts for you! Tell the truth and shame the devil! I don't know what they want from me, man. I I feed them, and I clothe them, and I rejuvenate them. (laughs) Inflation, baby! Buckle up, boys and girls, and get ready to ride raw. With the realest, trillest sports and guy talk show in the world. This is the Doug Stewart Show. Yes! Talk that in my ear, but let that shit come down here. Yeah. 
Monday, baby. Talk in my ear. Okay. All right now, I'm bigger one for Yeah. Ain't no more players. Let's go, Stewies. Let's go. Nice. It is a Man Talk Monday. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And thank you for joining your boy on the Doug Stewart Show, the real and shrewd sports and guy talk show in America. Yeah. Woo. Good morning, y'all. Big, big Monday. A lot to get to today on the Doug Stewart Show. You know we're going to do it. But first, fabulous. Bring it back. Nice. Oh. Yeah. Hey, uh, thank you for joining your board, the Doug Stewart Show. This is a man. Talk Monday. What up, though? Oh, boy. <laughs> Happy Monday to you once again. Thank you for joining me on the Doug Stewart Show. If you're new to the show, this is to the new people listening to the show. We got to get some, some business out of the way first. If you're new to the Doug Stewart Show, um, trust me, you've made an incredible choice in your life. Yes, you have to tune in to the realest, treeless sports and guy talk show in America. All right. A couple of things I need you to do, though. Go to Spreaker.com if you're not already listening to the show there. Go to Spreaker.com. That's speaker with an aura. Search and find the Doug Stewart Show. Once you find it, hit the follow button. That's very important so that when this show or any other show on the network goes live, you'll get an alert. And the second thing I need you to do is to click on the little chat bubble. We have, it's like a a, a chat bubble icon, kind of like in the comic books. We have the best chat room in the world. I call it the Fantasy Island of Sports and Guy Chat. And its inhabitants, the people inside that chat room, I call them the Stewies. Good morning, Stewies. And so post your thoughts in the chat room. I read it all throughout the show. It makes this the most interactive sports and guy talk show in America. And, yes, it is based on sports. But it's guy talk. It's dude talk. It's entertainment. It's fun. It's it's, uh, social issues. It's politics. Whatever we want to get into, we will. There's no holes barred around here. Okay? You can also call the show. At 404-382-0338. You can also email me at Doug at the Doug Stewart Show.com. What will we get into today on this Man Talk Monday? We give out ballers and busters today as well, which some people call them game balls and goats. Some other shows call them game balls and goats. We call them ballers and busters, okay? So anything that happened over the weekend, we kind of highlight it by giving them a baller award or we give them a buster award. <laughs> Speaking of the Buster Awards, man, we're going to talk about the Oscars. <laughs> uh, we're going to talk about the Oscars, uh, O.J. Simpson a little bit, uh, Cavs loading up, and the Golden State Warriors as well. DeMarcus Cousins still being DeMarcus Cousins. That's right. Didn't get a chance to talk about this on Friday, but man, come on, Shaq. <laughs> what? Yeah, we're going to talk about Shaq, man. I mean, <laughs> uh, 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 we're going to talk about Shaquille O'Neal, man. He's got this beef going on right now that's just gotten out of hand. We'll talk about that. A little bit of NFL talk, man. The Dallas Cowboys celebrating the past. We'll get into all of that today on the Doug Stewart Show. Once again, the number is 404-382-0338. You can also email me at Doug at the Doug Stewart Show.com. What did your boy do over the weekend? Uh, Didn't do much of nothing. Well, you know what I did? I did do a couple of things. A couple of things went down this weekend. So I was uh, all set to go to the CIAA. And then the last minute, I decided, man, I'm not going to mess with it, man. It's a lot of walking. It's a lot of laying around, doing nothing but getting drunk with me and the bros or whatever, man. And so uh, my daughter had a track meet this Saturday, which she did very well. She came in 
Uh, where'd she come in? She came in second place in the 100 meter hurdles. Shouts out to her. Ball award to Kiara Barra. Yeah. There are only six girls in the race, though. <laughs> but she came in second in 100 meter hurdles, and she came in fourth. Uh, missing third, missing a, a bronze medal by like, I don't know, three-tenths of a second. But she came in fourth in the 100-meter. So good Saturday for her. Ball award to the LOP, the life of the party, the leader of the pack. Oh, yeah, and also, damn, I almost forgot about this. And also, man, once again, because I didn't go to the CIAA, um, I was in town, and uh, – uh, my homeboy, Robert Porsche, man, um, South Carolina State's finest, the low country's finest, got inducted into the Black College Hall of Fame this Saturday, and your boy was up in the house. Yeah. So for people that don't know, let me give you a little bit of background. So for people that don't know, you don't listen to the stews, or you didn't listen to the stews, or you didn't listen to the Doug Stewart Show, haven't listened to the Doug Stewart Show for the last two years. So Robert Porsche played like 10 years for the Detroit Lions. He actually was a teammate of mine at South Carolina State the brief time that I was on the team. Uh, and before we even got to South Carolina State, me and Porsche, Porsche's from the next town over from my hometown. He's from Hugey, South Carolina. And when I was a junior in high school and he was a senior in high school, we actually attended the same summer school class trying to get eligible so we could play football. <laughs> yeah. It was like an Algebra 2 class. And so, so the, the class was actually at my high school, Berkeley High School. And this big 6'5", you know, burly dude rolls up in the class the first day. And so, you know, obviously he's just a football player. He looks like a football player to me. And we talk and, uh, man, been friends ever since. And then it's crazy. And you're listening to the Doug Church. We need to get Porsche on Chop It Up. I just thought about that. We can definitely do that. So so he's from the next town over. Uh, we attended summer school together. We both transferred to South Carolina State. Literally, we had to sit out a year the way they did it back then. I don't know if they still do it like this now. But when you transfer, you know, schools and one uh, in uh, Division One schools in South Carolina State at the time was a one AA school and still is, I believe. So when you transfer, you have to sit out a year, you know, before you're eligible to play or whatever for the new school. And so we actually transferred, and I bumped into him in the weight room, like my first couple of weeks on campus. You transferred? You transferred? Yeah. And so we both transferred, and we we had to sit out this year together, and then. To add to the story, when he gets drafted in the first round, he gets drafted to the Detroit Lions. And a couple of years later, my little brother Ryan Stewart gets drafted to the Detroit Lions. So we go way back. We go way back. So he was kind of like, you know, this guy was an all-pro. Made it to like three Pro Bowls. So he was kind of like a mentor, big brother to my brother. You know, uh, uh, away from uh, away from home in Detroit, and so uh, so I didn't go to CIAA this Friday, and uh, saw him Friday night at a little get together that alumni had from our school, and he was like, "Man, if you still want to go, you know, I can I can I can take care of you." And I was like, "Man, it's funny you say that. I'm not going to CIAA. The really, the reason I didn't plan to go to the to the um, Black College Hall of Fame ceremonies because I thought I was going to be in Charlotte, but I wasn't. But he took care of that. I actually sat at the table with his mom and his daddy and his sister, man. Great people. Congratulations. The biggest ball award on a Monday to Robert Porsche, Black College Hall of Fame. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah, big ups to Porsche, man. Real, real big stuff, man. Real proud. When something like that happens, man, it's just a sense of pride. It's just a sense of pride. Like, you knew this guy before he was big time and, you know, the superstar. And, uh, so it's just a real, real good feeling, man. Congratulations to him. 